What's up guys, Gims, and welcome back to Pro Cycling Manager 2021 for yet another episode of our Pro Cyclist. First episode uh, made in 2022, uh, first video actually of 2022, so I guess Happy New Year. Uh, hopefully 2022 brings the best for you. Uh, but for us today, well it's probably going to be hell. Brought up on uh, as we'll have Paris-Roubaix and then my favourite three races of the year, Amstel, Flèche and Liège. Uh, and then we'll, we'll do Romandie because funny. Is this Tion 2000? For fuck's sake, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna lose there, I guess. Then, um, I don't think I can win at least one classic. Um, I don't think I'm gonna win Roubaix. I got 71 calls, maybe one monument. Who knows? Uh, well, I mean, at least one uh, Ardennes monument would mean Roubaix or Liège. Uh, and then try to like not do too badly in Romandie for the end of my fitness. All right, not the best of days for the team. Uh, I've got a plus two on Stefan Kuhn, which I'm guessing makes him co-leader with me. I mean, I'm guessing my plus four makes me co-leader with him more than the opposite. Um, he's going to be what, 78? Yeah. 78 with 80 flats. I've got the same thing. He's got much better secondaries than I do, although stamina is quite high for me. All right. There's things aren't looking too bad. Uh, we've got a plus three on Pelican. Do I know him? Nope, but he doesn't seem good at anything. Maybe prologue in time trial. So I don't think he's going to be really a key for us. Um, I think from memory, Mathis Louvel has decent ish stats, Clement Davy as well. Only issue is I'm not leader. Uh, what's my strategy today? Get in the breakaway. Yeah, no matter that, I think. Um, but all right. All right, uh, we'll take a look at the uh, race conditions for most of the leaders later on in the stage or in this race. But I've got stats ish to get a top 10. I usually get a top, I mean, I've won with 78. So I reckon I can get a top 5 with 76. And we've got a crash, we've got a crash. Peter Sagan. Peter Sagan has crashed, or Peter Sagan, or whatever pronunciation. Suits you the best, the uh, co leader of Jan Bovesma, plus 276 for the Slovak, but currently at the back of the peloton. Uh, his leader, though, 78 with a plus 4. I don't like that. Mathieu, plus 2 with 81. Kaspar Asgren, fuck me, plus 482. Tish Benot, 80 minus 1. Steuven, plus 478. He's already won the Anderson Remo. Could he add Paris Roubaix to his uh, list of monuments? Plus 4 and 79 for Von Barla. Fucking hell, okay. Uh, Seb Von Marker. 80 and 0. Early Nazan. Could this be his year? Plus 280. You never know. Anthony Turgis. Could we have a French winner? On Paroubet. Plus 180. Possible. Not likely, but possible. Matteo Trentin. The leader of, uh, of FAPL, FAPL with Hugo Hofstadter as well. It's a plus 276 for the Frenchman. And it is... A plus 377 in case the race isn't tough. Matteo Trentin definitely has a chance. Dylan Tunes is there. Christophe Laporte is there with a plus 278. That's all right. Nils Polit will be one of the last leaders we'll check. Uh, and mainly because he hasn't given me his race day condition. Vielen Dank, Nils. Trouille de Rambertheim. Uh, I don't exactly know why Mathis Lubel decided to attack, but he did. So I'll allow it. Also, Tom Dumoulin just told me to keep my strength to help him uh, like further on. No. The only one I'll, I'll like take any advice from here is Stefan Kung, and I'm not even really sure I want to take advice from Stefan Kung. All right, we have an attack by Stefan Kung. Um, I mean, I guess he's following an attack, to be precise. I'm going to get dropped here, unless them lot stop attacking. So please, stop attacking at the front. Why? Why is Hugo Hofstetter the one attacking? For fuck's sake, Hugo, man. I think Stefan King might be done. Because he's attacked, dropped me, got dropped, I came back at him, I have around two and a half times his energy, but he doesn't want to help me. Stefan, I'm like, come on, you're Swiss. You're meant to, to just be neutral and like help people out when they need. And I need help right now. I need your help, Stefan. Yeah, sadly, I'm done. Uh, the, the, there was an attack. I couldn't bridge. I, was, I wasn't far off. I wasn't far off from bridging. It was two UAE guys and... Um, might have been Marco Hala, actually. Yeah, it was Marco Hala. 
But when they usually stop, someone attacked up front, couldn't come back. Uh, I guess they'll be 14th place to, well actually might, might even be worse. Because somehow, Wout Van Aert is there. And I had not seen that coming. And the winner of Paris Roubaix 2025, I think, is going to be none other than, I actually have no clue right now. Uh, don't tell me that's this repair. Kasper Asgreen? Josh Steuven? Jasper Steuven! Milan Sanomer and Parobe for the Belgian Rada. Asgreen, Van der Poel, Polit, and Turgis to complete the top 5. Christophe Laporte in P6. Uh, Marcus Hulgard was the, the UXT Rada, the, the Unox Rada I had seen. Um, so, yeah, I kind of lost to, to Hulgard, which pisses me off. Uh, and for us, it's going to be like 21st or something. All right, I'm still time. Work at the head of the group for 40 kilometers. Do I look like I have to work at the head of the group? I've won the Grand Tours, for God's sake. We just had like four crashes in a row for the team. Or at least three, Rudy Mollard crashed. I think Kevin Jeunet crashed. And maybe Michael Woods? Someone else has crashed. Maybe not Michael. I don't know. Maybe after, there was only two. Uh, but yeah, Rudy Mollard just crashed. Um, quite important, knowing that he does have a plus four. And is somewhat decent at this whole thing that we call cycling. He just came back in the peloton. Um, but yeah, a few crashes here and there. Dylan Tunes is the main one as it's actually withdrawn from the race. Uh, so for the, um, the Belgian leader. And uh, what team does he ride for? It's Bahrain, right? Where's Bahrain? I know it's the Middle East. So I, he only had a zero. So he wasn't going to win. Uh, we've got a good data for, the, for this. We may have a chance at winning. Many attacks in uh, the end part of this Amstel. Already 12 kilometers left, but you know, the Amstel is on PCM, it's not exactly the most thrilling the races. Uh, as Maxi Schachmann just decided to make a move, we're the most represented team at the front. Because for one of the first time, I think, in my life, I am seeing every single one of my teammates still, still there. It's m miraculous. It really is. Um, I'm the one with the most energy. I mean, I said I asked Kevin Jeanette, how the fuck did Jeanette... Oh, okay, he, he got water and got dropped. Well, I guess someone truly bottled it then. Um, well, we got a few attacks here. Peters is at the front. Interesting, I thought he would be riding for himself. Especially, especially sorry, with that plus five of his. But maybe I'm wrong. Uh, 6k to go. I'd love to take the wheel of someone, but I don't know who's. Is Madra still rocking 85, 83 hills? Okay, good. Um, so he's basically a favorite. Okay, how does one handle this? Oh, is this finish? Oh, I'm not good at this finish at all. I do not like the way this finish goes. Um, all right. Well, I'm going to take an L, let's be honest. I'll take the of Pitters. Hopefully, hopefully that gives me some sort of an edge. How, how? Oh, for fucks, I took the will of the only guy who has no energy. Are you mental? Well, we're done. Uh, we're not going to win this. Marc Hershey? Marc Hershey seems to crack at the very end. Does Pogacar come back? Does Von Aert come back? On the line, it's Marc Hershey taking the win. I'm very disappointed because I took the win of the only Donny that had no energy whatsoever. Not even a bit of red. Uh, I mean, it's another plus four for Flesh Wallon. But usually it's the one I never win. I mean, I say that, I haven't won anything this year. So I'm not really sure I can say that there's something I win and something I never win. Hmm. We'll see, but... Unlike Panic at a Disco and Brendan Urie, I don't have high hopes. Is that another crash? By Joe Timms? I think it is. He's crashed on Paris and he's crashed now. And he's already got midway energy. I swear you're meant to be good in, in like, hills. What is, why is Joe Timms' point? I mean, this is somehow even less interesting than the Amstel. The only thing I have to mention, genuinely, is one crash. Whether it was Rudy Mollard three days ago, or whether it was Joe Timms today. Wout Van Aert is attacking in the Côte de Chirave. Why? I, I get that, I, I get that you're good. I, I know this. There's no need to attack in this climb right here, right now. However, following David Godu, 
could be a shot. Les cours acrobatiques descendent. Please don't do a Milano San Remo myself. Don't, don't I dare Milano San Remo myself. And that happens. Let's carry on following David. 3k to go. I'm gonna use my gel. Gap is 20 seconds on the peloton. And I'm gonna make sure to take the relay of David as soon as he's out of energy, which he is. Oh, am I gonna win La Flèche? There's actually there's a, there's a there's a possibility in which I win La Flèche today. I know they came I know they came back at me, but I have energy for the flat portion. Oh my god, I'm winning La Flèche! Oh my god, I'm gonna win La Flèche! <laughs> Get in there! Come on! All right, final race of the uh, treble, Liège Bastogne Liège. I would say that it's one I can win. But I feel like saying that I can't win things unjinxed me in the previous attempt. So there is no way in the hell I am winning the address on Yesh. In shocking revelations, Drew Team has crashed again. So he's crashed on the flesh and he's crashed now. And also he's got a minus five. I don't know what Total Energy did to wait, his uh, fitness or fitness plan of the season or planner or whatsoever. But God, was it shit. Interesting that... Interesting to see that Valentin has very little energy. And he's only been released to me as a potential teammate. I'm really struggling to understand how the AI manages their fitness in this game. Like, it's genuinely baffling. I'm trying to like find a scenario in which I'm not going to lose this. I can't find a single one that would actually work here. Uh, there's an attack here by Tim Wellens, Tadei, Conchi, Hershey, and Wout van Nau. Uh Ideally, I need them to stop doing this, which they have, thank God. What's the end? All right. They've just attacked and they've got a lot of red again. Like, what go on? Can't you just, I don't know, feel the, the need to rest? Today is gonna be in my wheel, which isn't good. Um, all right, let's try to stay at the front of this group for now. If I can get energy on Valentin, that's good-ish. Because I'm gonna need him ASAP. Is that world already going? Why? Okay, I, I, it's, I think it's official. I'm, I'm too dumb for PCM. Like, sure, the AI has probably got a master plan somewhere in their head because I, I don't i don't get it wait me oh my god what one we just won Liège by some years we just won Liège by some years all right uh after a glorious campaign in belgium uh we're going to get another friendly country with france another neighboring country with france should i say we're in Switzerland for the Tour de Romandie. And it's with a time trial between Oron and Oron. More of a prologue rather than a time trial, if we're being honest. Uh, is there any steeps? Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess that's kind of steep-ish. We'll try and uh, not finish last. Although that should not be too hard considering we have uh, stats. Rather incredible, if I am being honest. And as we cross those uh, pink sponsors, it's B5 across the line for us. You know what? I'm feeling ambitious today. Uh, I feel like uh, I feel like I can drop the riders in my wheel, right? Yeah, surely I got the legs to do that. Let's attack now. Push it. Who's there? Carabas, Ethanator. I'm sorry, did I just see 82 hills on Ethanator? Fucking hell. That is a progression and a half for the British champion. Those are some pink stats. All right, is Carabas relaying me yes or no? I'm gonna go on the basis that it's a no. I mean, he's gonna bully me in a sprint, but at least, at least I've I, I made headway regarding the like the, the the classification, I guess. Yeah, he's he's gonna batter me. Uh, that's fine. I'll take P two. It's okay. It's the win for Richard Carapaz. Uh, just ahead of me. There's probably not even gonna be a time gap. And thirty second on the peloton, led by Nata. Good day for Rockstar. Second. Oh, sorry, first and third. 
thoroughly uh, thrilling stage for uh, number three here in Romandie. We'll try and now that we'll have uh, Richard Carrabas, El uh, Jaguar de Tulcan. But it's going to be a win for Timothy Wellens ahead of Lutsenko or myself. Myself. Yeah, myself and PTU Lutsenko in third. All right. I think this is one of the stages I hate the most on PCM. Well, not the stage itself. Is this climb. I, I don't know how to win this climb. I don't think I've ever won in Tour de Mille. And actually, as a matter of fact, I don't think I've ever, I've ever finished within three minutes of the winner. <laughs> Now, for the first time ever, also, why am I in time today? This in my stream. My apologies for that. Uh, I completely forgot that I have the best rider in the world. And a plus three. So I better win. Otherwise, I'm really worse. I'm like the worst player on PCM ever. Richard Carapaz, current second place of the GCN, probably my biggest enemy, because I've just checked. We have the exact same mountain, well, mountain stats and fitness. All right, we started Tion 2000. Um, Tim Wellens has attacked. I'm pretty sure that Carapaz is back. Oh, there he is. Uh, he is in our wheel with a lot less energy than I do, or than I have, sorry. All right, let's ask Mr. Tommy Dumoulin to, uh, to transcend himself. I don't know why he's wasting too much red. Like, I'm pacing 78, not 89, so please, like, I don't know, slow down or something. Uh, wait, there's a breakaway? Why is it? Wait, why is Sir just a meteor first at the GC? What wrong with that? Okay, he's 742 down, so he's not exactly a threat. Uh, and 8k to go. We should be able to catch him. Yeah, we. I, I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be fine. Uh, Geoffrey Bouchard isn't fine as he's going to be dropped. And that will be the case for Tom Dumoulin very soon. How am I already on my own? Like, what? Why? I've, do I've done nothing but pace. Also, uh, Mr. Carabas. Is gaining energy back on me. Why? Is it because I've paced and he hasn't? We just came back at Sergio Simitier and Richard Carabas is the one trying to bridge us then. Alright, 2.3k. Uh, if Mr. Simitier could block him, he is not. Alright, this is going to be a battle to the death. Because we're both with very, ye very little yellow. We, we both don't have red. When I say that, he's got some red and some yellow. He's got more than me, but I've got 33 seconds. Again, more pink signs or purple, whatever color that is. Uh, I'm not colorblind, just dumb. All right, no, he hasn't sprinted. It's a win. It's a win in Tion 2000 or Tion 2000. Good. All right, we're on the way. Uh, 14 kilometers of an effort. I believe my gap is 50 seconds? 53 seconds on Richard Carabas. Technically speaking, I'm fine. All right? I know I'm shit at time trials, but there's no way I'm losing 53 seconds to Carabas. Like, there's physically no way. That can't happen. Final kilometer. Uh, we're currently P9. 10 seconds behind Ghana, the intermediate. Let's be realistic. We're not going to win. My objective was to win. But across the line, it's P2. We did a quite a stormy, well actually it's P3, quite a stormy second half, but we're going to win the Tour de Romandie though. And with uh, the GC win of Romandie and qu quite a ridiculous episode, because we've won Flesh and Liège, we're going to wrap this up here. Um, hope you've enjoyed it. The next episode, Mercantour, Ventoux, actually I'll just do that on my own. Alright, next episode then, French Championships and start of the Tour de France. Hopefully we can do as well as we've done on this episode. Because there's a 2022 Karani to begin. On that note, my name is Guillaume. Have an amazing day. See ya. Pass me the funk, get your funk on girl and don't you ever let Pass me the go. funk. We're getting drunk in here and what comes next.